handling the mounting pressure. Dunedin Mayor Dave Cull was among civic staff taking up the offer of a free blood test at work this morning. With the electoral race heating up, one could expect his blood pressure to be higher than normal. But he says that's not the case. It's all right, yep. yep. The more I took it, the better it got. Cull says his doctor checks his blood pressure regularly and he's encouraging others to follow suit. Stroke Foundation community advisor Judith Hislop says hypertension or high blood pressure is a key marker of stroke. The higher the blood pressure, the more uh, strain it's putting on the arteries. So it allows a bit of the uh, plaque or perhaps a blood clot to break off your artery. And the two places it's more likely to get stuck is your brain or your heart. So basically a stroke is a brain attack. Free blood pressure tests like this are going to be available throughout the country next month, with volunteer agencies helping out. Since John Ambulance first responder Annette Tiffin says people's readings vary and it's important for them to know their own average. Well it depends on the individual. We've got a little pamphlet here which gives an indication of what a high blood pressure could be, which could be anything greater than 140 over 90, but that might be the norm for someone and it could be exceptionally high for someone else. And if ex exceptionally high, then what we would say to the person, well, if you're concerned about it, you would need to go and see your GP. The Stroke Foundation recommends people eat more fibrous fruit and vegetables, cut down on salt and quit smoking. The organisation, along with St John and Rotary, are hosting free blood pressure tests at Pack and Save and New World Supermarkets on Saturday, October the 1st. Darrell Beza, The South Today.